Hello everybody, Don Campbell here and I'd like to show you today how to create a custom page template uh, in WordPress to eliminate the sidebars. And So I'm showing you how to do this on the small biz theme um, which is my theme on uh, expandtoweb.com and the reason is have, I've had a lot of people say hey how do I build a custom home page or a page on my site without the sidebar um, but maybe you only want certain pages with sidebar and certain pages without so I found a pretty cool way to do that. In the past I've um, pu published some blog posts on how to create a custom page template but in, in those ones you actually had to edit the PHP code to put the content on your page and so I found a much cooler way to do this. I'm going to show you, show you how. So what you need to do is create a custom page template in WordPress and then what you can do is when you go create a new page, which I'll call I'll call this one my new page or something like that. I'm going to use the visual editor here. And when I create a normal page on my site and publish it, let's go take a look at how this what this looks like. So it shows up on the menu automatically, and when I go there, I've got some text that I can edit, uh, but I still have the sidebar. So if I wanted to create a new page um, without the sidebar, it would be pretty difficult, but what I'm going to show you now is this ability to create a custom page template. And when you create a custom page template, it shows up over here on the right hand side and it allows you to select from these different page templates. Here I've created one called No Sidebar. And if I pick that and update the page, then you're going to see that the sidebar goes away. And <clears throat> what's cooler is if I add, let's, let me just repeat this text a bunch of times so that you can see. Um, give me one second here. Just want to have a lot of text so you can see how it wraps around. So I'm going to update the page. And when I go back to take a look at this, you'll see that the sidebar is now gone. And at the same time, I can still edit all this, uh, this content on the page right in the visual editor. So I can add um, pictures to this. I can do all the forming that I want without having to know HTML. So that's the way you do it. It's really cool. Now let me show you how you actually uh, make that happen. So I'm going to go look at uh, my WordPress directory. Over on the left here you're going to see this should look familiar. This is the root directory of my WordPress site. I'm going to go to WP Content, Themes, and I'll go into my theme, the Small Biz theme or whatever theme you're using here. And I've created this page template called No Sidebar and it's very, very simple. Basically it's just like the other page templates that I showed in previous blog posts where you give it the name and this is the name that's going to show up in WordPress when you choose your page template. Uh, this code indicates that hey to WordPress this is a page template. This gets the header so I preserve the header of my site and this gets the footer. But this is the magic code here. You need to provide something called the loop. And this is special WordPress code that uh, within it, within this loop, I can say I want to show the content of whatever is in the page. So this is what basically allows me to edit things in the visual editor and have it still show up on the page. So this extra bit of code here in the middle I didn't really talk about in my last video on how to create custom page templates. And that's what gives, is kind of like the magic of allowing you to edit the, everything about your page in here and then have it still show up here without having to build it all in as HTML. So anyway, it's pretty straightforward. Um, I hope that is helpful to you. I'm going to um, minimize these now. So anyway, the whole idea is that you can go in, create the page template, that little snippet of code, I'm providing that in the blog post, and then you can do whatever you want. Customize your home page or any other page on your site as much as you want. So thanks for watching, and then leave me any questions in the comments below.